Coach, what? Uh, how was your first uh, meeting with with Peyton Manning when when you went up to Indianapolis? <laughs> and and how soon did you realize you probably knew he was pretty good when you went up there? But uh, like, how, how, what was it like coaching him? I knew he was good. I knew he was special. But um, he actually came to my opening press conference. Then he came in the office uh, afterwards, and he said, "Hey, I don't know what you've heard about me. I don't know how much you know about me." but I want to win and I want to be coached. So you just, whatever we need to do to win, make sure you get that across to me and let me know exactly what you want done. And man, when you hear that from your star player and you know that he's on board and he's going to be the guy that is going to promote the way you do things, uh, it just makes it so much easier. And uh, we have still have a great relationship today. The one problem that we had uh, was really a funny one. When in, in Pittsburgh with the Steelers, Coach Knowles' practice was always to have Saturday be family day. It was a short practice. He made it lighthearted, but you brought your kids. And so I, that's what I was used to. When I got to Tampa, I did that. Our players loved it. When I got to Indianapolis, I said, this is the way we're going to do things. Saturday mornings, we're going to have this short, light practice. The kids are going to be there, and we want them to see where their dads hang out. Well, for four years before I got there, Peyton's, uh, his routine was he would write everything down Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, every play that wasn't perfect, and he'd want to run them again one last time on Saturday morning. But we would have these conversations, and I'd say, Peyton, well, you know, Family Saturday has won a bunch of Super Bowls. Family Saturday has won a bunch of Super Bowls, and uh, I know it's not your routine, but we can make this work. So grudgingly, he kind of went along with that. And fast forward, after I retire, he gets uh, moves out to Denver. And I'm working for NBC, and I go out there to cover uh, the Denver Broncos. We're going to have them on, on Sunday night football. One of the players comes up to me and says, you will never guess what Peyton Manning did. He went to Coach Fox. He said, we got to institute Family Saturday because he had <laughs> twins now. Yeah. <laughs> it changed, it changed a little now. bit. Yeah. They didn't know where, where their dads worked. We, so Denver had Family Saturdays, and I, just, I was cracking up. I said, man, we have come full <laughs> circle. But he did get to see the benefit of it, and he saw how these guys connected with their kids. And even though it maybe took away a little bit from his concentration and what he wanted to do, um, he saw the value of it and they did it in Denver and that just warmed my heart. Oh, that's a really cool story. 